It was amazing to see the, the concert hall completely sold out. You know, certainly I don't know what, what it's like here in Germany really, but, but back home in the UK, um, we have a lot of sort of older audiences and the young people don't really go. So I think if you can find a way to get, in, get into the schools and, and make them realise all the things that, are, that music has to offer them, Don't, don't cut that note short. We don't want to have Well, it was a fantastic morning um, working together with the students here. Two soloists played and we worked on a, on a piece together for approximately 15, 20 minutes each. And then a quartet played, played a, a couple of jazz numbers as well, which was good fun. Okay, so I'll give you four in. And a one, two, three, four. Ba, ba. They were very enthusiastic um, and they were very attentive as well. So when I suggested maybe them trying a couple of things differently, they did it straight away. <laughs> okay, and now, and now up, so shoulders back, and now... Oh, yeah. Is that easier? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, cool. All right. Yeah, it was it was fascinating to, to work with them and, and, and see and see a school in a, in a different different environment. You know, I'm used to the schools back in the UK. This was a little bit different. Um, you don't normally get so many trombone players, so that was fantastic. And it was nice to get some some feedback about the the recital I did last night in the Elbe Philharmonie. Um, nice to see all the students there as well. Actually, I find it really inspiring to hear their questions and their eagerness to learn. Um, I always think with, with younger people they're so enthusiastic and there's almost, there's no filter. I think I have an issue in the way that it's delivered to, to students. So if it's delivered in a sort of relaxed, easygoing manner and it's not just pushed upon them, you must listen to this, listen to this, and they have a chance to, to judge it for themselves and maybe go along to a concert occasionally. That's the best way to do it, just gradually start feeding, feeding stuff in. When someone says, I didn't know that could happen, and you've made them think, that's all I can ask for. Even if they don't like it, if they, I want to make people think. I want them to have an opinion, basically. So even if they hated it, then that's okay. Because at least they've listened, you know? They've listened, they've been along to the concert, they've been open-minded, and they've gone away and they've made their opinions. You know?